Okay, looks like we have enough time for one more. Um, Far York Farm. Far York Farm looks kind of fun. It looks like there's a mine, so I should be okay. Oh. Why is there an ADA log for this one? Isotopic analysis indicates last intelligent activity at greater than 100 years. Surface remnants consistent with thriving civilization. Three orbital satellites remain in orbit and one is transmitting data in a loop. The data contains the following image. Farm. Cool. Alright, so let's take a look at this. What the hell? Okay, haven't run into a dark tower in a while. Oh yeah, there's little farms. That's cute. Okay, so I picked this map because I thought it was going to be small and easy to clear. It This actually looks like it might be one of the bigger maps that I've run into so far. I'm curious what the maximum map size is with uh, map generation. Anyway, we might as well head for the Ultrax. I don't know what's in them, but start there. Go, what the sh... is what? Shazza? Okay, that's a really crude looking dropship. <laughs> Uh, it's funny to funny to look at though. Okay, so I see a couple of segments that are mine. I want to take this if I can. That dark zone is inconvenient, and I don't know what this is. A sweeper. There's also an info cache. Weird. All right. Well, first and foremost. We start here. Do that. Okay. So I want to do that small sweep to get a bunch of power. It's going to be... We're probably going to get hard locked about here. So this will be my... Per, supposed defensive line? No. These are not lined up. There we go. Okay. And then somewhere along this, I'm going to set this up. Hopefully. Well... You know. Seeing as this area is kind of its own, we also have Anti-Creeper. Let's just make the most of it. I'm still going to want to hook that up, probably. Let's just split that out a little bit. Okay. Uh, so in that case, let's just do a porter. This area is largely inconsequential, but if I can take it and hold it, that would be lovely. And yeah, we're, we're barely using any of this. Okay. This, on the other hand, looks like it's a fair bit further away. This is probably going to reach it first. We might want to just kind of pylon web out. To get access to as much of it as possible. Unfortunately, build speed takes a little while. It's unfortunate. Yeah, if we had some more ARG here, I would potentially consider making trying to make an M rift real quick. Uh, but I think we're out of luck. I'm just going to use that to slow them down. Okay, let's try making a couple of cannons. Ooh, chat. 
Works for me. All right. Cool. That means I really got to motor on finishing this. I got some chowder. Okay. Just about in time. Uh, let's see. I think, I think I'm going to rally the horses around this. This is probably a no good. Oh. Speaking of alt no goods. This guy is cheating. He's taking the back door in. He's probably still going to get mired a little bit. But I'd prefer to head him off if, when, and where possible. Okay, did I build? I built this. Cool. So now at least we can keep these supplied with a constant stream of energy. What I'd like to do... Not a beacon, a platform. Okay. So I gotta get a factory down. We've got the red on. We're gonna need to worry about missiles. This map is huge, and I have I have covered in in an extreme amount of stuff. How's my use? Bad. I mean, tons of resources, especially once we get those mines online. But otherwise, I think we'll be in a semi-comfortable position. Uh, let's go up here. I'm going to plonk a mortar down. And then connect that. We're going to need some snipers. Because I don't think I ever actually applied snipers around here. Okay, other thing, they're starting to encroach, but we're okay. My my energy generation is going to go through the roof. Okay, that was not a good look, but I'm not sure what that was. Okay, and I'm going to give up on that for a hot second. Okay. I do really want to get a platform down. We're starting to get the stuff for it. I'm going to stop that until we know that that's not going to jeopardize it. Because I want to hook these two up. If I if I can hold this, we're in a comfortable position. Okay, keep expanding the grid. Okay, gotta get some backup mortars here. Some mortars in general, that's... that's a lot. That's a lot! Okay, order here. 
over to here. Let's move this up. That's a ton of creep. I might have to shelve this one. And come back to it a little bit. Nope, maybe, maybe this is a sufficient amount of mortars. Maybe we'll be okay. Move that up a little bit. What even are we contending with? Okay, we are going to be contending with pretty much everything. Okay. More mortars. Okay, so I want to do special platform. We're not quite in a spot where I can build an M rift yet. Let's see. There we go. Gosh, yeah, that's. That's a lot. Oh, it's probably this stash. I think that's exactly the answer. Okay. So we've pushed them back. Or at least they're not making immediate headway anymore. That was a concern. For a brief moment. Okay. Speaking of... Not the best of spots, but that's okay. Oh no, that's a porter. I want a terp. Okay, considering how rough the terrain is around here, I think we want to get some high ground. Okay, and we can finally turn this on four times speed. We might need some more mortars here. Okay, so next order of business, mines. I've been putting them off for some unknown reason. But they present the biggest immediate opportunity for me. And also my biggest potential weakness. As they can and will destroy me immediately. if this area gets flooded. That's okay. All right, out of that. Uh, let's see. How are we looking? We're looking decent. Okay, a little expensive. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. But as soon as these are down, we're suddenly in the money. Ah, they took the hill. That's okay. Let's let's get the rest of these mines down, then we'll think about the rest. Cuz at this point I can build a lot of mines real quickly. Yeah. 
There we go. And as soon as these are down, then I can really go on the offensive with just endless guns. Okay. Perfect. Suddenly we went from like no energy to all of the energy. Okay, so let's get let's get this back up here and let's absolutely blast it with mortars and one cannon. Main reason being it needs to be able to hold some things off. Holy shit, we haven't lost this yet. How? Okay, terraform. What is this height at? Is that only 10? Like only 9 or 10. I'm gonna just convert that mountaintop into something a little bit more immediately defensible for me. I'm gonna attack this. I said it, I'd need to go fast on this map, and I... Like, I picked this map because it looks kind of small. I was wrong. Okay. So, a couple of immediate problems here. This side is starting to fall. It's getting overwhelmed, and it's running out of resources. Um, it still has a decent amount of ARG, surprisingly. So I might actually be able to pull this off. Let's get a pair of snipers, a missile launcher, and a cannon. And use it to go over here and hopefully connect to this whole network. While we're at it, give it some mortars. And maybe a couple of cannons. And then once we have this hooked up, I'll build an M-Rift out here, and that way we won't have to worry about it getting disconnected. Speaking of, same deal out here. Oh, flattening this out actually seemed to have had the opposite effect that I intended. That's okay. Plus side, struck, nope, terp. Other thing. I think that th this is going to be the thing that saves me the most. Let's do some crop dusting. Let's just start with one set. Okay, create squad. Now we've got, near as far as I can tell, two of these. So we're just going to start mulching them with flyers. Like I said, we should have more than enough resources to... to do everything we could possibly want. Okay, you're squad number two. Because if, if I want to be able to speed through this, we got to do that. Okay, let's let this roll for a bit. Okay, so let's check the damage. We've done some horrid thing. Wow. Yeah, okay, we messed him up pretty bad. What is this thing? Delegate. Interesting. Uh, Well, first and foremost, I think I can finally pull you. If I can grab it. 
Okay, here we go. I can finally pull this over here. Oh, but let's let's do it here. Let's be sensible with this. Mortar, mortar, mortar. And let's build another. Uh, we want to specifically build a porter, but for red on. Or arg, specifically. This is hectic. I'm going to ignore it. The reason we want, why we want red on... Ooh. Suckers are power hungry. We want red on... Or, not red on. We want arg so I can specifically make... Uh, I mean, a couple of different things. Okay, let's start with the sniper. Because this is going to get problematic if I don't. Wait. I should never have done that. I think that'll be fine. But the, the sniper was a mistake. I guess I'll do a shield instead. That seems like a better idea. Because while I would like to get rid of those, or put a sniper down and protect this, uh, those eggs are going to all pop if I let it do it. Yeah, back to Creeper World 4. Yeah, I haven't played in a while. And uh, I wanted kind of a filler game. We've got a ton of games coming out on Thursday that I'm, I'm really looking forward to, but it's going to take a long time to get through all of them. And so I didn't want to I didn't want to start any new major things, but I could play Creeper World for like a couple of episodes. Okay. let those go. Did that actually... Oh, that does straight up just destroy those. I shouldn't have done that. Oh, it's fine. Okay. Back to this. Get a pylon down. Here. Here. Surrounded in cannons. And then get a nullifier. Uh, let's see. Let's get some basic missile defense here. How are you? Yeah. Alright, so that generates a bunch of eggs, but isn't immediately a problem. There's, oh, th there's another emitter over here. Okay. Here's what I'm thinking. I've got loads of resources. Let's just get a lot of guns. With, like, layers of redundancy? Because why the heck not? Okay, hook these together. Boy, that's that's still just kind of hanging, ain't it? These weird spikes are amusing to behold. Oh. That's the other issue. Well, let's take a look at this. So these bombers... Let's see. Select squad. These bombers no longer need to be shooting at that. They need to hit this area. I did not notice there was a, uh, a massive amount of... replicating ground.
Uh, let's see. Squad. Effectively, right where my mines are. But on the opposite side. Let's let's just empty this out as best as possible. Oh. No, that's awful. That, do that doesn't help anybody. Okay, just hit this zone in a much more general sense. Alright. If I'm, if I'm going to want to deal with that, let's get a pair of porters again. And then a ton of cannons. So I'm pretty sure... Oh, wait, I did use an urn. Why did I put it on these things? Oh, because I'm a... I'm silly. That's why. I meant to turn them always on, but that didn't... That didn't end up happening. That's okay. Let's ignore that for a second. Oh, they took this upper area out. Rude. Okay. We're just going to have them go into the general area. And then cannon rush. It's not going to be perfect. Ooh. We might lose an amount of energy charging these up. We'll see how it goes. Hey, thank you, Neliel to Odershvank for the nine-month resub. Snom. Thank you. I wonder if I ever use the blimps. I don't think I can make them. I can make the rocket, but there's no blimp. Um, the blimp specifically is like an endgame tech, but only for the campaign mode or certain specific missions. And so I jokingly use them right at the very end. And then pretty much never again. Okay. If I can knock this down a peg or three, this gets a lot more doable. There we go. Okay, so that dries this up real fast. Okay. And while this is normally incredibly risky... Oh. I guess I can't do it anyway. I was gonna have a sniper rifle that actually... Well... Earn portal. I'm gonna turn on energy collection. And fire rate. question is, can I get these eggs to pop? Not easily. But at least can take this squad. Uh, do we want to... Here, let's, let's start beating on that one. Okay. I guess we do want the sniper after all. Okay. My best solution would be to come up here, get a bunch of mortars, and then protect them with a couple of cannons. 
I can at least spare this one on top of the hill. That way I don't have to try and move it normally. This map's actually a little laggy. Okay, so let's let's go back up over here. Let's switch you to Arg. Arg, perfect. Looks like it's still maybe got the same route. Okay, cool. So this way we can get an M rift down. Thoughts are get an M rift in this location. My strategy suddenly becomes a lot more flexible, and we can potentially guard against missiles. Alright. And let's rebuild this thing. My assumption is it probably got knocked out based on... Either a flyer or something else. We will see. Okay, put that there. Take this upper section. We've got a sniper. This is going to get kind of dicey, but I should be able. To, I, I should be able to push it. But yeah, I I picked this map because I thought it would be small. I was very wrong. Unfortunately, it means the game can't handle it very well either. Okay. In that case. We should have the M-Rift, yeah? Yeah. Nope. We want cannon. Okay, we also want Missile. Move that here. Hook it up. Get a Sniper as well. Sniper might be a bit dicey, but I think I'll be okay. Okay, and let's, let's just build more cannons than we, than we know what to do with. So if I can take this back, I mean, this is pretty heavily cowed. As is this one. Actually, I pretty much just passively killed that. Okay, maybe not. It's not quite yet. Question, can I? Yes. Hook that up. Uh, let's see. Sniper. Oh, I can't get a sniper on the rock? Aww. Okay, I have a shield gen- No, I'm gonna leave that shield generator there. Okay, let's do that. Which pushes the eggs elsewhere. But otherwise keeps this area fairly okay. Okay, looks like we're fine. Back to this. Actually get some pylons down. Ooh. Yeah, just... Just getting to some of these is a trial. And shit, look at all those eggs. I was not expecting this sheer quantity of egg. Okay. 
In that case, you've got to go over here. Big issue is we're actually using too much red on. I gotta get rid of those. Okay. Get another nullifier. Yeah, it's dipping off a little bit. Okay. Gosh. Wish there was a way I could safely delete eggs. Oh no. How how even? Well, that solves my red on limitations. Let's see, Rocket Rain would technically do it. Yeah, I've been I've been honestly forgetting where is it? Rocket. We can build two. Okay. So far, so far, so kind of good. And that's a bit of a risk right there. Okay. Let's try this again, but with cannons. I don't know why I didn't build more cannons up in here. Let's see. This is the M Rift, yeah? Perfect. Let's just extend a number of these out. Because I think one of my biggest issues is truly just getting enough energy out to these locations. K kinda. Baseline, no matter what, this is rough. Uh, let's see. At least I should be able to get the nullifier down, no problem. Who needs shields when you have bullets? And I don't dare move any of these guys. I, I realize that it would be convenient to start utilizing some of those turrets that I've just kind of left behind all over the place. But I really don't want to do that because if something, if even just the hint of creep hits that area, it's daunt and I'm in trouble. Okay. How's the rest of this area? Eggy. The big issue is reaching Eggsville. I'm doing lasting. God damn it. How? How did how did you manage to take out the nullifier? It was probably like this singular egg. Okay. There's still 
This guy is spitting how many eggs? More eggs than any any man should be able to egg. Like Eggman's jealous. Well, at least I'm generating bad energy. Okay. I'm like equal parts almost done, but at the slowest and the hardest section. It's only... Always the stinkiest part of uh, Creeper World is just that, that doldrum where you're just like, man, I know I could win it in just like a hot second. I guess it should probably just rain. Set a number of those off. Unfortunately... I think my better option, truly, is using selective shield generators to just shove the eggs off the map. Oh. Did I ever free this, like, city area? I didn't comfortably. But it didn't have to be comfortable. It just has to work. If I can get these... These four, I might be able to do a souped up, uh, a souped up shield generator with some serious range and just force the issue. Because I think. I think historically that has had the most amount of effect. Alright, let's give that an urn. If I can get it? There it is. Move it here. That's about to get frustrating. Okay, was that one of mine? Every once in a while I hear an explosion and I get kind of worried. But I'm not seeing anything on the graph. Okay, here we go. This guy needs to move. And this guy moves up here. And what that'll do is that evicts a lot of the eggs. Many of them will pop. Many of them won't. The most important part is just to shut this thing off. Even for a little while. Because if, if this is no longer outputting egg, then I can actually focus on cleanup. poorly timed, but it's okay. We're good. Oh, this is... Did I never actually nullify this? I swear I did. I think I did. I'm pretty sure I did. Okay, so... I think my, my strategy... Oops.
my strategy worked. And we can actually do the exact same thing, like, right here. In fact, we're already, like, halfway to it. And that's the last big problem. Yep. It gets mad when this happens. No, but we're fine. Okay. Okay, question is... Nullifier has to be right there. Okay, let's just give it a thousand cannon support. This is solid. I can probably move the shield generator. I could make another one and maybe be fine. Seeing eggs get magneted over to places in need of them is very spooky, to be honest. It, yeah. There's a lot of places where that could actually uh, put a hole in my my defenses. And I'm glad so far they haven't found purchase. There's a couple of spots, like right here, that could have actually gotten slammed. Yeah, holy shit, I have no sniper rifles over here. That Yeah, that would have gone real bad. Okay. Get that there. And do a couple of mortars. A couple of cannons. Why? It just like spawned an egg and my shield just ran out of juice. You earn want. I almost wonder if I'd be better off. With multiple of these. There we go. Okay, weapon, nullifier. Let's try that again. I think we got this. Gosh, that's a lot of eggs, though. Okay, so that gets us some lift to that totem. Where is all of this, frankly, coming from? That's the wild part, is that despite the fact that I think I've I've wrecked every single emitter on the map, we're still just tangoing with so many. I might be coming out of a couple of these spots, but... I don't necessarily know why I did that. I guess it's fine. Here, if I put that there, that'll shove a ton of eggs away. Might pop a lot of them, though. Eh, it's worth it. Okay. Weapon... Cannons. Okay, keep them shields up, keep everything else good. Okay, 
And that's still solid. Ain't pushing any further. So what else do we have? Oh no, that might be an M Rift. Okay. I'm trying to figure out where my enemies are even at this point. The answer is I think it's that dark zone and then this. Let's just do that and evict. Turbo evictions. Let's see. Get you down. Some guns down. Because a lot of those are probably going to pop sooner than later. And I do not want to be dealing... I don't want to deal with that when it does. Okay. This area is kind of relatively competent. I'm just going to give this a rate. going to give this a Rage Sniper. I don't think an inversion would do anything. If I did a Singularity, but like over here. Would that actually... That's fine. Holy shit, I have a lot of these. We're just going to do a, a tri-conversion. That sends out a bit of a wave, but my guns are generally at the ready. And leaves it, this dark zone actually, I think, largely in my control. the greatest, but that's okay. Uh, let's go beacon. Let's see. How am I doing? I might as well get an M Rift, like, right here. Just so we don't have to worry about it, anything moving in. So we want to take all three of these. Luckily, there's no creep on it, so I can just, I can walk right in. Okay. And then I think I think this is the end of it. I think we're done. Yes. That took about 30 minutes longer than I meant meant it to. Some of these maps are not the easiest. At least it wasn't one of the re really ridiculous ones. I mean it was kind of ridic ridiculous, but having that that much energy generation so I could just dump planes on them pretty much chef's kiss all problems solved. Oh, the reason why the, be the beacons are taking so long is because all of my green R is being put into rockets. Infocache, if anyone reads this, I hope you found a permanent way to deal with the entropic fluid. We thought the dark rift beam would save us, but the entropic fluid missing data. Because all of this, all hope is perhaps not lost. I hope you found it, and I hope it worked, but I'll never know. Oh, I think I need to nullify that. What is a dark... Oh, dark tower. Right, right. Right, right, right. Okay, so now all I have to do is find one more tower somewhere on the map. It must be on my end. Oh, there it is. I was close. And come on. Needs nine liftic. 
All right, we're good. Now. This caused problems for myself. There we go. Honestly, I think just raining a bunch of times probably would have been more successful than using conversion. But it's fine. We're done. Hooray. That took a time. That was a big map. That was a big map. All right. Well, that's it for Far York Farm. I like this. I'll probably put in a couple more episodes uh, before the end of the week. We will see. It's really just once Biomutant comes out, my time disappears. But that's still a week away, so I think I'm okay.